All right. We're playing an expert difficulty here. Give the healing spell to you. Extra hit points over here to you. Flame Whirlwind to you is great. And Revive Blessing to you. I'll go for Frozen Amplification. A couple skeletons here shouldn't be too bad. We're going for an idle build. I want to see just how good at healing and buffing they are. They're like a healer, but also they like they buff damage and stuff. I'll give Icy Multi Shot to you and Frozen Amplification to you. I'll go for the speed boost because I want the elite portal bonus. I want you to attack the number three guy, so move these guys back a little bit. I want you to aggro on number three if you can. Oh, what are you doing? You're what is happening? <laughs> Why is he dancing around like that? I mean, it works out to my favor. I got special hits on him. Just need to make sure my healer can heal up number two well enough before this guy, you know, dies. Seems promising he's gonna be close. I think that dancing around helped a little bit. We get him. And there it is, the Mega Speaker turns my hero into an idol. And those are the stats right there, and that's the ability. Healing Scattershot, great, give that to you. And Speed Boost is well on you for now, but probably want to switch to all healing spells. Overload 2, I'll take it. Put that on who's going to be my Berserker down here. Actually, move this around. So I want you to be my Berserker, and you my fighter. More defense for you. Doesn't matter, just OCD thing. Flame Whirlwind Slash, level wants to go for it. Oh wait, no, you're gonna be my- I'm confused. No, you're my mage. That doesn't matter, I'll, I'll rearrange it later. You're my mage. You're my- what's- what's all that? You're my berserker. You're my fighter. We're doing well. She did no damage because all she does is buff. Flame Whirlwind on you. Crystal Defense over here. Let's go for this healing scatter shot one. See how we do here. So she's healing everybody. She's buffing everybody's attack speed. Give more uh, stats down here. Seems to be working out well enough. Grab the overload, grab the healing. I can just put these on you for now, because why not? Go for no more attacks over here, because I want the elite portal. And see how we can do over here. You got the overload so you can attack quicker. That's good. Dealing with the riffraff over there is good. How does her healing ability seem good? Seems like she's healing not that crazy much. This maybe is how much healing they've like received. It's gotta be, because open this. There's the mage, become my mage. I don't plan to use this. That's a physical attack. I don't plan to use that either. Not until I get my fighter. I'll go for explosive shot too. Equip that my archer for now. I already gave you defense, give you some hit points. Berserker needs to be a tank too. Healing scatter shot, we'll go for that. It's the idle video, so I want to showcase just how crazy they do things. I mean, we're putting out great damage right now. It's amazing. Love that. It's hard to gauge how much of that is because of you. Go ahead and work on my healing scatter shot. Level one, level two. Here's power can hang out over here. So while the idol has some healing capabilities, it's more about their support. Let's go for Fire Whirlwind Slash. It's hard to measure their stats down here, because you can't see it down here. So the real way to measure it is going to be just looking at the stats of other units and seeing how well they do damage-wise and how fast their attacks are going. I think that's going to be the biggest measure. Yeah, because she's basically just buffs attack, defense, and hit points of my other guys. And she has some healing too. Let's go ahead and get my uh, level 1 here. Into a level 2, real early, that's nice. Guess we can give you Icy Shackles for now until we get better spells. Melting Shot Elite Portal. We really have one tanky unit, I'm not sure if we'll have enough healing for you. I mean, my damage is absolutely crazy right now. We're melting these guys very quickly. That would be the overload speeding us up early in the first, uh, I think it's like 5 or 10 seconds. Yeah, 5 seconds. There's my warrior or fighter or whatever you want to call it. I'll take both of those for now. I'm not going to equip either. Heavenly Song. Let's go for this. I think that's her a unique thing. Plus 20 defense. Give it to you. What's your defense? 62 is pretty good. It's a group heal that also applies strong to everybody. Take out the basic healing spell and give you this instead because it's better. Let's go for Frozen Shield. Need defense for my warrior here and also this guy probably. Front lines with you. All we need now is to turn this guy into Berserker and then we got all our classes that we need. Damage seems pretty good. Fighter's doing a ton of damage. What's happening over here? What? You're supposed to be my tank, not my DPS. Works for me. I don't need another mage. Honestly, we're doing fine. Just kind of keep things as they are for the moment. I do want another crystal defense. All right, got some mages over here. Their sound effect is relatively loud, but we'll take care of them soon enough, right? Yeah. Wish there's some way to, like, gauge more easily how much of the stat boost is coming from her, but I guess that's the tricky thing about support. Get that speed boost. Is that I can't check their, like, stats down here. There's no stat for, like, how much buffs did I give? So it's really just watching everybody else and seeing, like, are they doing good? Are they attacking, you know, for good damage? Good defense? Seems like, like, I can, like, check my strong stats over here. Yeah, that's strong. So that's, yeah, 10 stacks of strong, extra 10 defense, extra 200 hit points. 
Yeah, right there. This little stack, this little icon right there is what you're looking at to see just how much she's buffing. I'll take all these. Shop time. Upgrade the shop. Level one. Level two. Level one. Level two. I'll put healing one on you, because it also casts more stacks of strong, and you can do the uh, attack speed buff. Level one. Level two. Both these are tempting. I'm gonna go for Frozen Burst too, because I think it's good damage on the mage. Swap out that, maybe. I do need to get my Berserker, though, would be nice. Having the mage do a little bit of healing is fine, too. I think this, if it gets to level 3, I, I forget if this is the one that does crazy damage or not. How's my healing? Not good enough. You need better defense there, sir. Uh, please don't lose a soul here. Oh, that was close. We almost lost a soul. Healing's not good enough. There's my Berserker. Welcome in. Get you cooking. Clearly, you need more defense. I'm not sure how much the speed boost level 1 is helping. More damage would be good. This is only level 1 for now. Let's give you level 2. Actually, I can't stack 2 the same on there. I mean, we're not that far from getting it to level 3. I'll take it. Damage is kind of evenly split among you guys. Alright, now we got the Berserker who's got an AoE attack, and the Flamewind World also attacks an AoE, so... Yeah, we're gonna melt guys pretty quick here now. That was nice damage. Berserker does great DPS. Grab the Shackles. Don't care about the Evil Covenant. Healing's tempting, but gotta go for the Elite Portal, because uh, if you don't lose any souls over here, you get books. Which is very good. Got some healers in the back over there, but we're not crazy worried about them. They should go down pretty quickly, actually. Bill's starting to come together. I'm going to take off Explosive Shot and give you Fiery Shot, because it's a physical melee thing. I mean, Melting Shot too, why not? What's 8 attack? Give it to you, I think you'll get the best value out of it. Grab the Melting Shot, I'm going to sell it. Not worry about any of these. Got some Goblin guys over here, go ahead and take them out. Not worry about it. Now we got the Berserker and the Mage. I think are, we're going to be pretty good for a little while here. Save some Elite difficulties. Speaking of Elite, go for the Fiery Spiral and the Elite. Goblin General over here has Healing Strike 3 as an ability. Got Warrior as well over there. Uh, how are we going to do? The A the Flame Whirlwind on the Berserker is very strong, so that's good. Not worry about Ice Thrust. I mean, it's level 2, but Frozen Shield. We need Armor stuff probably just for survivability. Once I get to level 2, maybe. I mean, I could just take off the damage and put it on right now for better survivability. Put more hit points on my Mage. I don't want the Healing Scatter Shot, but Flame Whirlwind is actually going to be pretty important too. Alright, so how are we doing? We're chilling. Where are those strong stacks? There's five stacks new. The fight's over. Special event. Extra stuff. Bunch of spells over here. That's fine. Take them all. Fiery Strike. Not worried about it, but I want the portal for the book. Another Goblin General. The team synergy is strong. I like the idol. The one th problem is I don't really have an easy way of gauging just how much value they're providing to the team. Basically, look at the stats down here. Don't you die, Berserker. Berserker needs more defense. Noted. Take all these. Your damage is great. I can take off Overload of you and give you Frozen Shield because it gives you an extra 15 defense. This guy can have Survive Will for 15 defense. Go for Healing 1. More hit points. I'd like to put it on you, so I'm going to do that. Although, I mean, fair, you need it. Everybody needs it, really. Let's go for Ice Elemental Thrust 2. Try that one. My uh, Berserker nice in the middle so we can do like some big AoEs with Flame Whirlwind. If I put extra hit points on my guys in case they get attacked in the back. Hey, we can level up Burning Fireball from level 1 to level 2. It only attacks one target. This attacks AoE. I see Shackles this synergize well. You're only level 1. Let's give you a level 2 one of these. I mean, Ice Elemental Thrust level 2. It's it's an Ice Mage build. It is an Ice Age build. Ice Mage. Go for Furious Power because I want the book from the portal afterwards if you lose no souls. Got a Goblin General, the Healing Strike 3, and the Goblin Priest with Speed Boost 3 and Healing 3, so... Uh, Y'all want to heal. I mean, you're hitting my guy for a lot. My healing is really insufficient. This is a problem. Please, we're gonna lose a soul. You're, we're gonna lose a soul. No, we lost a soul. My damage is atrocious all of a sudden, so that's not good. I mean, you're actually putting out a lot of damage. Problem is you're better AoE than single target. My healing's not good enough is what's happening right here. Take all this. Go for Overload. We lost one soul, we get five left. Go ahead and fight you guys. My problem is my Berserkers. Your defense is, what, 85 with the buffs. You're, uh, 147. Just, he's got way more defense. Berserker, I need to, like, keep you away from the boss, I guess. Have the boss attack the fighter first. Take all these. Definitely go for healing. I'm actually gonna move you back one tile and put this guy in front, and I just want them to attack that guy first. No, that's not, uh, particularly much better having you attack my mage. Because their defense is actually kind of alright. 67? What are you at? 87? Not terrible. Please don't die, mage. Please don't die. Heal the mage. 
My healing's terrible. Level 1 healing. Level 2. So if they're in the revive state, we heal again and cast strong. So we want guys to put revive on themselves, which is what this does. Level 1. Level 2. Plus 30 defense is a lot. What if I were to give you this, and then give you this? 60 defense. 97. It's never gonna be the same, right? Because one of you is meant for defense. Let's go for healing again. Try this once more. Get as many of them to aggro on you as possible. They don't seem to want to. They seem to want to go for my mage, but they finally settled down and attack them. My healing's a bit better. Um, a third healing spell, maybe. Maybe I could put a healing spell on the mage could be useful. Just level up the healing stuff I have. Go ahead and grab all of this. Go for survive will. Move you guys like this. Try it out a little bit. You guys stay busy over there. How's my DPS, my buffs? So, what you do is you improve defense and hit points. And it's a little bit of attack, but mostly it's just defensive stuff. You he Yeah. You mostly buff their defense, not offense. So survivability is how we gauge uh, how strong you're doing. Can't fit everything here. There we go. Shop. Level 1. Level 2. Level 1. Level 2. Upgrade the shop. Level 1. Level 2. Level 1. Level 2. We definitely want Revive Blessing, because it makes them cast Revive on themselves, which makes Healing 2 heal for an extra 50% and also give Strong to them. Highly enough, take off Overload and give you this. I don't need you for damage, need you to, to survive. Another upgrade there gives me of this. Level 2. Level 3. Level 1. Level 2. Level 1. Level 2. Heavenly Song also applies Revive on my guys. Might make this a little bit redundant over here. Boss time, Icy Shackles 2. Goblin General back there. Here's a Sandworm, has basic attack and boss immunity. Let's see how this fight goes. So the main thing with the idol is they do some healing, but also they help give, like, defense buff the longer the fight goes on and more hit points to my guys' fight goes on. So they're really like a... They really shine with builds and fights that go for a while. The fight's over in five seconds, they, their whole strong thing doesn't have much time to do anything. Yeah, that's an extra, what, 13 defense on you, more hit points. Their hit point, yeah, about 2,500 hit points, doing great over there. Just need their healing spells to get a little bit stronger. While the fight goes too long, we lose by default. Level 2. Level 3. More defense on you. Go for level 2. And now we're in a snowy biome. My guys all start with... Oh, wait. It says blessing and uh, blessing reviver, different things here. How's my survivability looking? So her whole thing is that she doesn't heal quite as well as the priest. I'm kind of, this is my first time playing her, just learning her. And, you know, this recording session. And it turns out she's like, doesn't heal quite as good, but she helps for long fights. So build your team around long fights. Go for the healing strike one, because it's elite. In an elite portal, rather. See how we do here in this icy biome. And how's my survivability looking? Pretty good. They both have revive on by default. So the first casting of this uh, does double value for healing. Their survivability is looking really good. They're barely taking any damage, so... Looks like she's... I feel like the idol kind of weak early, but gets stronger as the run goes on, maybe? Arctic Domain 2, grab all that. Go for Overload 2, maybe I slap that on... If I get confident in their defense, I can give that to somebody. Level 2, level 3. Let's give you some more defense, take off the Survive Will, and give you Overload 3. Let's go for Revive Blessing. Okay, now you should do some, like, crazy damage early. I mean, the fights going longer is good for, like, giving my guys more defense, but also it does run the risk of it takes- if it takes the full 60 seconds, you just lose by default, so you don't want to take too long, right? And the defense, it seems to be working. We, we're untouchable. My healing's not even that great, it's just we're not taking that much damage in the first place because of all the extra defense. Level 1. Level 2. Triple Slash, don't care about that. Go with Survive Will 1. Doesn't really matter, I don't want any of those. Right, here we go again. Can we deal with all of you? Alright, doing a little bit more damage to me. So far, we seem alright. The, the overload having you, like, melt these guys early does help quite a bit. And you guys are just getting absolutely bodied over here. How's my damage? Berserker's doing insane damage. Overload 3 would explain that. Go ahead and level this up. Level 1. Level 2. Don't worry about that over there. Go for the Elite Portal. Don't want any of those spells right now. I think we should be okay over here. Yeah, look at him just running over there, just melting us really quickly. You attacking those guys is not the best. The Flame Roll Run level 3 on Berserker, absolutely insane. The AoE damage this guy does. Go ahead and grab both of these. Go for Arctic Domain 2. Defense on you just in case. You're up to 90, should be fine, I think. Go for the healing. I think we should be able to handle this just fine over here. You're melting them pretty quick. 
I mean, they did take away a quarter of your hit points, so it's not like we're just kind of free. I don't think she heals quite as well as a priest does. I feel like if you're going for like really, really short fights, priest better, but the fight's going a bit longer, maybe idle? Because all she does is just like, I healed not as good, but I give you more defense over time. If the fight lasts five seconds, that defense over time doesn't really mean a lot, because well, it takes time to build up, right? Doesn't matter what you go for, don't want any of them. This seems fine over here. I mean, we're doing pretty well. We're on expert difficulty, we're in the snow biome already, and we're feeling largely unchallenged over here, and... I like the extra hit points of these guys. I mean, look at the extra hit points they're getting. The extra hit points is actually really nice. It's not just extra defense, it's also extra hit points, and the hit points is... It's a substantial amount. Not worried about fire, not going for a fire build at all. Go for the elite. Mostly just want to like level up things I already have. Got some goblin, is it? Axe Kin's hard to say, it kind of like glitches over the other text. Demon Warrior, they've got a healing strike too. I think we should be okay over here. I mean, they're actually doing fairly heavy damage to my Berserker, although the spiel, the health, the, the health spell I got cast there healed him up pretty nicely. But yeah, him taking out enemies faster is pretty nice. The the mage is not doing much damage. We didn't we did not choose a high damage build of the mage, but she is slowing them nicely. Level one, level two. Go for survive will too, why not? Ooh, special event. I'd rather have gotten the spell. I guess these sell for a decent amount. Puts more attack on you. I feel like you're not doing as much as you could be. Arctic domain, whatever. Should be able to steamroll through this, I think. You got your little spell casting guy over there. I mean, there's a lot of enemies here. But my AoE damage from the, the Berserker is just doing fantastic things. The Ice build mage, there's a high damage build for the mage. I don't think the Ice build is it. It's not bad. It's doing all right. Doesn't compare with uh, another build that I've used on them before. I'll take all that. I don't care about any of these. Should be fine here as well. So far, we're just kind of strolling through the snow biome. I mean, they're taking away a third of my health there. That's a little bit scary. Luckily, the Berserker's taking them off fast, but they're like, as long as we survive the first, like, 10 seconds, we just get stronger and stronger and stronger, we're having more and more hit points and more and more defense. I guess gauging how much hit points they have is a good way to tell how many times she's, like, buffed them with her, uh, revives, or her strong ability down here. Level 1, level 2. Go over the Heveling Song. I'd like to get that maxed out. You guys are level 32, and there's a decent number here on the board. You are taking more damage than this guy. What is your... Uh, you're 133, and you are at 174. I guess you just had higher damaging ones attacking you, I guess? Or hit point difference? Hit point gap? He does have more hit points. Grab all that. Take the flame blood veins again, not super worried about it. Level 30s. How are we gonna do over here? There's a lot of- man, it's just doing so much damage to my- This is supposed to be my tanky guy, but his hit points melt more than this guy every time. Uh, maybe it's because this guy's just clearing out enemies faster. But it's fine, though. It's, it's just getting stronger and stronger. Extra hit points. He's got 12 extra... Uh, 12 extra defense when you have as much defense as these guys. Doesn't seem like that much. Take all that. Maybe it's the extra uh, hit points that's the real thing. Level 1. Level 2. Level 3. Curse me, I didn't need to actually get these ones. Level 1. Level 2, because I don't think it goes above level 3. I'm just going to sell you. We'll upgrade here. Level 1. Level 2. Level 3. Even more healing. A lot more healing. Needed that. Level 2. Level 3. 60 more defense. Level 1. Level 2. Level 3. 50 more defense. 180 defense on you is crazy. You need it. Level 2. Level 3. Level 2. Level 3. Level 2. Level 3. Out of money, I only have two things left to get to level three. None of these matter. Source Priest. Magic Bullet Scatter 2 and Boss Immunity. A lot of hit points. I guess you guys hide over here and you guys fight up there, I suppose, and see how it works out for us. A lot of sound effects. Noisy boss here. Healing's pretty good. I don't, even though you're attacking the mage directly, they're not taking that much damage, which is good. Although you're taking a lot of damage. The healing is great. Lots of hit points. We got a lot of extra defense from that. We're doing great work here. Absolutely destroying them. More defense. Slap on you, I guess. Now worry about these. Time for the fourth area. Gotta defend my guys. Oh, they do so much damage. I'm gonna lose a soul here right away. That's not good. Oh, don't everybody die. Don't everybody die. Two souls lost is not great. I need more defense on these guys down here. Oh, they turned into little souls when they died. Imagine that. I should put some defense on you guys. Grab whatever here. 
You guys hit for a lot of damage, huh? Protect you desperately. You guys trying to protect them. We might lose the run in this area just because my my two magical dudes are super squishy. We don't do well in the first five, ten seconds of the fight, usually. Because you don't heal well at the start. You heal well later on. Huh, gold. Useless to me right now because I think this there's no shop for the next boss. Grab whatever here. These guys hit for 120 is crazy. Try and keep away from my dudes, if you'd be so kind. Leave my little, uh, mages and healers alone would be great. At least take a while to get to them so they have time to, like, get some strong stacks, rush defense, although four defense is not that big of a deal. I'm not gonna lie, my instinct tells me a priest might be better than the idol. I don't know. Maybe I need to, like, put more meta progress into leveling the idol up. Need a different build. I mean, defense enhancement too might be okay. Ooh, you're gonna get attacked right away over there. Try it like that, because she has 25 defense and you only have 10. So better have the idol attacked first than the mage, perhaps. An extra 15 defense is notable. I mean, it's working. We're handling these guys fine. These guys aren't too bad. So the other guys that really messed us up. Also, placement was probably bad in the first area. Not worried about it here. Yeah, just keep giving me these guys. These guys I can handle hopefully just fine. Stop leaving gaps for them to attack my mage. She's the squishiest one. We're doing fine now. It's just when I, I had them, I guess the first area I had them spawn right next to like high damage dealers. Oh, there's a shop, okay, never mind. There we go. Level one, level two, level three. Much more healing. Now I see more of these uh, revive blessings. Level one, level two, and we are out of money. Close enough. Everything level three ex except for this right here. Two of the robot sentries. And then the time guardian with 60,000 hit points. Maybe 80,000. Fire strike three, flame counterattack, fire spiral three or two, and boss immunity. Might be easier to protect you guys right now. Can I move around like that. Keep my mages away from the aggro guys. That's good. This guy's taking a while to... He wants to attack the, my berserker guy. Oh my goodness, he's melting my berserk. Oh, the heals though. We do well in long fights. Come on, heal him more. Don't let him die. The heals are just... So close. Okay, that's not great. He was my DPS and he's dead. My mage is doing good DPS. How many stacks revived do you have? Or strong? Um, it's getting a little bit extra defense. I mean, you're just getting more and more stacks of strong. And we did it. And there it is. You love to see it. And I have plenty more videos you can watch too. Like this one right here. See you next time. Advanced Hero Veteran. I'll take it. Let me try that out next time. See ya.